Shalom. First and foremost, I want to give all honor, glory, and praise to Yahweh and His only begotten Son, Yahweh Shai. Yahweh is the name of the one true God, and Yahweh Shai is the name of His only begotten Son, who the world ignorantly calls Jesus. And I want to give double honors to the apostles and the elders of Great Millstone. And I want to send salutations to all the Akim throughout the four corners of the earth, exalting the name of Yahweh and his only begotten son, Yahweh Shai, in truth and in sincerity. All right, this lesson is going to be about when we overcome this world and when we overcome um these uh the wicked basically uh we're gonna get salvation and when we get and when we get salvation uh the nations of this uh of this world are gonna be put in bondage uh by the uh, the elect all right when the lord returns the elect are gonna be the ones ruling all right yahweh shai king david and the elect all right they're going to rule this earth in righteousness. All right. Like the scriptures say, when the wicked beareth rule, the people mourn. But when the righteous beareth rule, the people rejoice. All right. So the people are going to rejoice. And not just, not just, you know, our people, but really the heathen, man. Because the heathen are going to be, uh, they're going to have their portion of uh, the earth once they serve their thousand years in bondage, all right? The, uh, the only nation that's going to be absolutely eviscerated and erased from this earth is going to be Esau Edom, according to the book of Obadiah, okay? But the other nations are going to have their, you know, uh, their land, and they're going to be able to live on that land under rulership of the Israelites, all right? So, you know, when when it when it comes time, these people are gonna go into bondage and they're gonna be serving Israel for a thousand years. Alright? This is uh Revelations two twenty six. It says, And he that overcometh and keepeth my works unto the end, to him will I give power over the nations. And he shall rule them with a rod of iron, as the vessels of a potter. Shall they be broken to shivers, even as I received my father. Okay? So these other nations are going to be break, broken into shivers, man. Alright? And, and, and we're going to have power over the nations. Alright? We're going to rule them with a rod of iron. Because the Lord gave them to us as a inheritance. All right. Let's go to that real quick. This is uh, Psalms 2 and 9. It says, uh, matter of fact, in 8, 2 and 8. Matter of fact, uh, let's start at 7. It says, I will declare the, the, the decree Yahweh has said unto me, Thou art my son, this day have I begotten thee. Ask of me, I shall give thee the heathen for, it, for thine inheritance, and the utmost parts of the earth for thy possession. Thou shalt break them with a rod of iron. Thou shalt dash them in pieces like a potter's clay. So these people are our inheritance all right yes people a nation of people as a inheritance for the israelites all right this, <laughs> it is what it is all right so the lord is, is going to give us our inheritance all right when all the smoke clears all right this is back in revelations 13 and 10 it says and he that leadeth into captivity shall go into captivity. He that killeth with the sword must be killed with the sword. Here is the faith and the patience of the saints. Alright? So, they led us into captivity. Guess what? 
they're going into captivity. All right, they killed with the sword. They're going to be killed with the sword. All right, the Lord said, "Think not that I have come to send peace, but a sword." That's see how was shy speaking. It was written in red. He said, "Think not that I have come to bring peace, but a sword." That's when he returns. All right, and and and, and Esau has killed us with many weapons. All right, and he's going to get taken down. All right with a, a bunch of ways you know saying nuclear fire any type of weapon which the you know, sword could be a representation of all right you know they these other nations are going down all right babylon is going down all right so when all smoke clears that we're going to get power over the nations all right so with that all honor glory and praise too Yahweh Bahashim Yahweh Shai.